Hello, my Photoshop and photography YouTube family. Thanks for joining. I hope you're having a great day. My name is Everett Christopher, and I do Photoshop and Lightroom tricks. I also do photography tricks and tips and tutorials. So thanks for joining if you are a first-time visitor. So today, Lightroom, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to show you how you can quickly remove imperfections like lens dust from a large volume of photos in a single click. So let's get into it. Okay, so what we have here is a headshot session that I did for a corporate event. There was hundreds of people that came through. And the issue that I have uh, that I noticed after the fact is I have, unfortunately, a small hairline dust. In fact, it probably is a piece of hair uh, at the top left-hand corner of the photos. So I'm going to use Lightroom's remove function and auto sync function to get rid of this darn thing in one click. So what we'll do, we're in the develop module of Lightroom and I have my first, well, I have the first photo chosen. I'm going to use command A to select all of the photos. We're looking at about 248 photos. Okay, and what I'm gonna do, normally this is set to sync. What I'm gonna do is select this little lever right here to change it to auto sync. Okay, then what I'm gonna do is click on the remove function, which has a few different modes. So it has heal, it has clone. The newer option here is remove. So with auto sync enabled, what this basically does is it will apply any changes that I make to this one photo to the rest of the photos that are selected automatically. And what I'm gonna do before we get started actually is just bring down the exposure so you can see what I'm selecting. It's this little guy right here, as I mentioned in the beginning of the video. And I'm gonna leave the rest of them alone. Let's get auto sync turned back on. Let's go to the remove option, the remove tool here, and then the remove mode. Okay, so I have that selected. And so I'm going to select this out. And instead of cloning or healing based on content from another part of the photo, it's just analyzing the photo and removing it, okay? So because it is an AI controlled function, it will take a few minutes to get through it all. So we'll wait for it to finish. Okay, so it has finished. It took about three minutes to get through everything. So we'll deselect, we'll get this one back to normal exposure. And as you can see, let's reduce the exposure on a few of these. In fact, what I can do is sync this. This is another trick you can use to do manual quick syncs as you choose a swath of photos in Lightroom and then click sync and then it'll give you this little window where you can synchronize your settings. So we'll synchronize the exposure. We'll check none here, synchronize the exposure. So you can see that uh, Lightroom has removed that little hairline dust. Okay, so that's basically it, short and sweet. I hope that helps guys. If you liked what you saw today, please consider liking the video, subscribing and clicking that bell, and we'll see you next time.